And turning to developing local news, 66 employees with the Jackson County Sheriff's Office could lose their jobs. This is as the county tries to negotiate a deal with the Employees Association. For more, we go to NBC5's Travis Cook, who is live in the newsroom. Travis. Hi, Rayanne. Thanks. You know, the notice comes as a surprise because there haven't been any layoffs within the agency under the tenure of Mike Winters. Those pink slips would cut back on sheriff's patrols and search and rescue operations at Jacks in Jackson County. Sheriff Mike Winters confirmed the layoff notices that were sent out on a seniority basis that will affect employees who were hired starting in 2003. The sheriff didn't go to, into much detail about the negotiations and in order to go public with the matter, county officials would have to give the union 24 hours notice, which was the rule that they agreed upon uh, from the start of that negotiation. Now the cuts would eliminate 24 hour patrols in Jackson County by the Sheriff's Department. Mike Winters says he plans on calling to other agencies to see how that they uh, how they plan to deal with the cuts. Those 66 pink slips will give employees just 28 days notice that their jobs will be cut. Winters also mentioned two corrections deputies who are currently in the academy that they're looking at that uh, they have been sent to notice saying they might not have a job when they get out. Uh, Winter said if the two sides, the county and the union, can come to an agreement that uh, some of these layoffs might be rescinded. Of course, this is a developing story, and we're going to continue to watch it as more information develops. Reporting live in the newsroom, Travis Cook, NBC5 News. Back to you guys.